What's up weirdos? My name's Cooper and you're watching Uncircumcised British Wee Wees. Yeah, so let's uh, just, you know, pop a button open, get comfortable, because this video is going to just ruin me. You know how in America we have things that are, like, called laws? <laughs> You know how we have things that you can't put on TV? But in the UK on Channel 4, which is their biggest channel, it's like their NBC plus Netflix. On that channel, they have a show called Naked Attraction that's just a bunch of British people getting completely naked. Then somebody comes in, judges them based on just their naked bodies and picks who they want to go on a date with. And they reveal from the bottom up. So, and you might be thinking, oh, that's so zany, what a funny video. But the thing is, it's not like Naked and Afraid like we had in America. You know, where they blur the peepees? This show is fully uncensored. They give you every little detail, every pore on every ball sack. I, I, uh. And the one we're gonna watch today is a woman choosing between six men's junk. And obviously, I can't put that on YouTube, so I'm gonna have to go in and edit black boxes over every genital. But just know that I'm watching the fully uncensored version and giving you, you know, what it is. It's a different kind of nudity. Okay, let's just, I'm trying to stall right now. Okay, let's just get into it. We like to start where a good date ends. Ooh. Ooh. I do love a handful. Naked. Oh my. <laughs> that was way more than I was expecting. Oh my God. The clips I get, I know what we're getting into, but then just a whole screen of Every single picture is a new wiener. <laughs> and they're all British wieners, which is, I don't know why it's weird, but it's its weird. Cause they're like historical. Like I think British people only have wieners in history. Like, oh God save the queen over the hair, little constable. That's how British people exist. British people exist in that way. And then women on Love Island. You know, over here, the villa are. Andrew Garfield falls under the Love Island woman category, obviously. I'm stalling though. Okay, let's keep going. Bear all for their potential soulmates. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh my God. I've heard of a Prince Albert piercing. I've heard tale of a penis head with a piercing in it. But I've never seen one, not even online, not even in the darkest depths of the internet. And then just on the biggest channel in the UK, just a guy rotating. <laughs> there goes that necklace. <laughs> the ring scared my necklace off of me. <laughs> Gustav, don't eat that. Aw, oh, that was my favorite necklace. Well, that was a 9-11 level personal tragedy. Okay, let's get back to the show, see if it can cheer me up. Kind of got a donkey cock. <laughs> oh, 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 why, why, why? It's not that big of a deal, it's not that big of a deal. I'm overreacting, I know I'm overreacting. I know I'm overreacting. This is literally like goes out on their television. British people have this in their homes, in their living rooms. A guy butt naked doing this while his wiener goes pop, 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 pop. Not a good looking one either. It's small and it's soft and it's like wrinkly. Why is it? <laughs> okay, okay, that's just the shocking stuff out of the way though. Let's get into it. That is a lot of penis in one room. The volume, really, the volume of the wieners. <laughs> and listen, I don't want to make it seem like the thing, I'm laughing at the wieners because when you just get a close up of a dehumanized <laughs> wiener, it's just, there's no person attached to it. It's just the wiener itself, mega close up. It just, it looks stupid. <laughs> pee pee for the sake of pee pee, more like, it what? <laughs> I'm gonna button up because this is making me uncomfortable. But that's, you know, what these people are here to do, show their wieners and hopefully kiss somebody. Do we really find yes. attractive? Nice for the girth on that penis. Sorry, again, thought this was like, you know, there's a there's a part of this where, where the show could be, oh, you know, it's celebrating the human body, it's destigmatizing it. There's nothing wrong, it's just us. But then they lather up these people with whipped cream and lick it off of them. And I and I, and I question the intentions of the show. If we're being real, the, the intentions of the show are put uh, boobs and wieners on TV. Hi, I'm Holiana. I'm 25 and I'm from Margate. Hi, I'm Holiana. I'm 25. I'm from Margate. Why is this so funny to me? It's like a Love Island intro, but she's just about to be faced with six dicks. <laughs> Hello, what's up? It's me, Holly Anna. We're here. Babes, I just came on the show to see some wieners. I'm so but, and that's the thing, she looks so sweet. She looks so wonderful and nice. I feel terrible that she's just about to go look at a bunch of wee wees. But that's what this show is all about. So let's go bottom up, see these wee wees. <laughs> Yeah. 
Honestly, this is, okay, maybe it was just the intro that was kind of crazy making it all sensationalized. This doesn't seem, you know, they're keeping it at a distance, they're not making it insanely graphic or obscene. Because if, you know, if they were doing close-ups of the wieners, I think that would be a different story of like, ugh, like just, ugh, I don't want to look at that. But keeping it, you know, at a wide shot, it's, that's, I, I, maybe I wrote it off too quick. Brilliant. <laughs> Maybe I didn't write off too quick. I love her though. I love her so much. Wiener, 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 wiener. <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> That's great! That's what we came here for, babes! Let's look at it going! I didn't think about this though. They're all... Hmm. You know what I mean? The, all the wee-wees are... Hmm. None of them are... Because hmm. that would be maybe too graphic and too weird if they were... Hmm. But if they're... Hmm. They just look very gross. Also, just, you know, off first impression... First of all, too close. I could have seen from a distance, but they all kind of look small and icky. Gus said it. I think like there were a couple in there that looked average and not gross, but most of them, I, I just trust me on this, look so icky and gross. A dehumanized wiener is one of the stupidest things I've ever seen. <laughs> okay. You're faced by six penises. Where do you want to go? I want to go to red. Come on then. So it's got great coloring. Yeah. And I think where it's got a little bit of a dark kind of pubic hair, it instantly draws me to that. It's a good size. Hey, Editor Cooper here. You might see some black dots popping up. I just, you know, there's reflections because of mirrors in my background. So it's the consequences of my own actions. Nothing is seen, okay? I blurred out everything. So don't go with like looking for times I missed it. I got everything. I've spent hours on this. Um, I don't think we need to be that close. Uh, Channel 4. I don't... <laughs> oh my god. She said... Oh no, let's go to the red one. Yeah, yeah, he's got some nice pubic hair. And then the producer went, okay, let's get right up on that. Okay, the nice, 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 I do not need to be that close to see it. And it's on national TV and they get a really close up of a small wiener. How are these guys doing this? How do you look at your wiener and go, yeah, we're not working with much. Let's go on the biggest channel in the nation and just whip it out. And they show their faces on the show, by the way. Salute them, we salute. So I've seen the scary ones and the ones that are a little bit not initially what you're thinking. Yeah. But there's certain positions that you can't necessarily have as much fun with, with a little one. What, with a little one? Oh, I see, they're just sort of yeah. banging away into an empty void. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> what? British women are the best, I love that. Is that a say? <laughs> it feels like you're banging away into the void. <laughs> That's a crazy thing to say. You know when they're a little bit small and they just start trying to go into your void. Poor guy, he's just sitting there while they're accurately describing his wiener as tiny. That's what I mean though, there's these people just sitting there looking at it, like right across from it, talking about his wiener. And it doesn't get, not even a little bit, is that the thing that happens on this show? When they're like looking at it, does it ever go? I would like to go to green, very hairy legs, which I really like. <laughs> not entirely sure, but what's happened could be a Sports injury? Bike oh. accident. Oh. I like a bike. Oh, do you? I do like a bike. Oh, stop, 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 Green. Green, stop it. Oh my God, have some decency. First of all, somehow even smaller. She's like, oh, I like his hairy legs. But interestingly, he has hairy legs and then a shaved bush. And his wee wee is so stupid looking. It looks so stupid. That's one of the. <laughs> It's one of the stupidest wieners I've ever seen. <laughs> but them talking about the injury. I did not need him to go like this. <laughs> right next to his wiener. <laughs> Just wee wee right there. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I get you can only communicate so much, but what a cartoon character. Icky response with the stupidest wiener. He has very firm balls. Okay. No, this is not allowed. This is the closest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. This is closer than when National Geographic gets a close-up of like a f***ing cricket's leg. They got the f***ing cricket leg camera up on this guy's ball sack. Oh my god, it's so gross. It's so, and so stupid looking. Why is that a real thing? Why does that, that's so stupid looking. Just dumb. It's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Oh, he's got a firm ball sack, but it's like, and peace and love to the guy. Again, peace and love, but... This close up, there's no, there, it's just, it's just not doing him any favor. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. I don't like the look of his sack. <laughs> looser balls. Yeah, they are looser. But, oh, there's a little bit of flexing going on. Pretty impressive. That's, that's a lot of straining, yellow. That's an impressive trait, but. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I, I, just the, the things that they're saying in this show that's being broadcast to the most households in their nation. This one's got looser balls. <laughs> and then, 
you couldn't see because it's blacked out. What he did was tightened his body and like retracted and descended them, let his boo-boos go up and down, and then they were impressed by that, obviously. So cool. <laughs> so funny, I try not to look that. <laughs> Nothing against them. I guess this is just what British wieners look like. I guess just in general, this is what you're getting when you're going to the UK. But. <laughs> I wanna go to orange. Penis. <laughs> Everything they say in this show is just gonna crack me up. Let's go over to orange and then they show the smallest wiener I've ever seen in my entire life. Penis! Ah, <laughs> uh, poor guy though on national- but he chose to do this. He's on national television and it's the smallest wiener I'm not joking I've ever seen. Slightly smaller than I've seen, but yeah. it could be a grower. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's a grower. Oh my god, this guy is the most insufferable person I've ever met in my entire life, and I've only seen his wiener. Dude, just accept it. You have a small wiener. Just accept it. You're the one who went on national TV knowing that that's what you were gonna be showing. Then the classic man thing, oh no, I'm a grower. No, I'm a grower. Everybody is biologically a grower, but looking at that, you don't have much to go on. Oh no, trust me, I'm a grower. Trust me. Yeah, that's called an erection. Can we have a grope, Blue? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a good bum. Oh, it's fuzzy. I'm going in. That's a muscly bum. What? What? You're the host of the show. Have some decorum. She just went in. She was going to spank it anyways. And she was like, oh, I I'm going in. She didn't even ask. She was just like, bam. Now imagine his perspective. He doesn't know what's going on on the outside. He just turns and gives his butt to them. And she goes, I'm going in. <laughs> oh, it's just a spank. Thank God. That was weird. That was so weird. Let me just look at his butt and then smack it. And by the way, his behavior, I don't think I'm going to be able to show this because of censoring. But he turned around and like grabbed his wiener and like lifted it up and like, pow, like flicked it. It's like, come on, man. Take a step back. Okay, but now that she's inspected all of them thoroughly, she has to go in and vote somebody off. And the only thing she's seen is their wiener and their legs, but their wiener, really. So based off of just that, she's gonna pick somebody to vote off. This show is so weird. It's so weird. But we gotta know who she votes off out of these six. Me personally, green is stupid and gross. Pink is stupid looking and gross. Red, that's just a wiener. Yellow, eh, take it or leave it. Blue, eh. It's, you know, it's a wiener. Orange is small and the guy was doing all of this. I'm voting him out. That guy sucks. Goodbye to red. No! She voted out one of my top two wieners. Oh my God. I thought that he was cool. Oh my God. This is devastating. This breaks my heart. This is Zarashon and he is an 18 year old stylist from Canada. Huh? Huh? He's 18? You put that on national television and ate a teenager's wiener? I censored it so y'all didn't see it. Why would they do that? He's a teenager. This show is watched by like people of anybody's age. He has his whole life ahead of him and he's been humiliated for the rest of his life. Based on just his wiener and legs, he got picked as the worst and he has to live with that for the rest of his life. We see his face. We know him. People who know him know that this is him. Know what his wee wee look like. Know what. How is this legal? How did they get? How did? How is this show able to be made? How is this possible? Why would they do this? Who did this? Can they go to jail for this still? Can you put this person in prison? Okay, there's a reason we have these restrictions in America. Y'all can say f all you want. This is. You can't do this. And you know what? At least for him, it was all like you know anatomical. It wasn't. They weren't being weird to him. But that's. It's not just you see it. It's his wiener, and it's the closest shot you've ever seen in your f life. I gotta like have a tolerance break after watching this episode and i didn't even finish the episode but that's the most important part if you guys like this i mean i will watch more of these and make videos about them but holy <laughs> so so many stupid wieners back to back what does this show give you other than the reaction of oh my god back up if you want to watch more l let me know in the comments I love y'all weirdos very much. Please subscribe. Generally, I have some idea what I'm going into. Like, no matter, I know what it is. Like, I know what the show is. I never watched things in advance. But, like, the my girlfriend lives as a toddler. Like, I knew that she was, like, a dumb little girl. I knew what the situation was. This, I thought it was gonna be like, oh, it's crazy because they're naked. But they're literally so close. So close on those wieners. And for what? Why? Who wants this? Is this, I mean, I guess, I, know, I mean, I know who wants this. I know people want to see naked bodies. 